One thing the church um, allowed our young people to participate a lot in the things that were going on. And if you had any interest in, in, you know, in the doctrine and philosophy, you tried to learn something to do that would be a part of the church service. So um, many of our young people were in the music department. We learned to play the piano and the organ, and we did the tambourines and the drums. So it's been around for quite a long time in our church, even though it's, it's, it's becoming prevalent in other churches now. But uh, I learned to play the music when I was eight years old. So when I came to church, I knew at least how to play a little bit. And then I stuck with the people who could play very good and learned to play the piano and organ in the church. And I still do that till today. I don't do organ much, but I do play the piano. Oh. And, so young people get, our young people basically do the music in our church. How does it feel to play the piano? Like, How does it feel to play the piano? Well, it's something you've been doing for, for me 65, 65 or so years. So it's a means of expression for me because I sometimes I just play things that I want to hear. And sometimes I play things that others want to hear. Some things I play, things that sometimes I play things I'm told to play. And um, it's a music is a means of communicating, you know, feelings and times and situations through the music that we sing and, and listen to. So it's a, almost anybody could understand it if you felt that mood or you, you, you saw things going on at a time where music is just communicating just with the sounds. I enjoy music. Enjoy, enjoy playing. That's good. Well, basically, it's um, Sunday school. We had Sunday school services. We had prayer. That was designated time, an hour, maybe in the mornings and on Saturday afternoons. And then our regular Bible class. You know, matter, matter of fact, we had a young people's group, and our do still have. The young people's group, just a regular missionary group, a brotherhood group, and several different musical groups that that uh, perform in our church. And uh, so basically, it was serving the community in every whatever way they wanted to come in and be a part of. I was built, finished, and dedicated in 1999. Um, a church, incidentally, good note to put down was debt free when we went in. It had been bought and paid for in cash. And it's about, I guess, close to $3 million church. Ooh, Lord. The church built itself a church with the Lord's help um, to make sure that we don't have a note facing us every month.